Kwento Bayani. Kwento Bayani. Magandang umaga po ng Sabado sa inyong lahat. Welcome po sa ating programang Kwentong Bayani. Ako po si Radyo Mon, Jenny Pahilangin ng RMNDZXL 558 Manila. At syempre aking partner Jojo Armenta ng BCYF ang tabayanan ho natin. Ano? At uh, kasama natin ang ating partner. Ang programang ito, Kwentong Bayani atin sa inyo ng RMN at ng BCYF. Tutok lamang, pakilangin and share na po ang aming programa sa RMNDZXL 558 Manila. sa programa ang kwentong bayani i-like and share niyo po yan ha at sa umaga ng ito ay medyo ano muna tayo uh, papalo muna tayo sa ating uh, mga kabataan dahil ang panauhin po natin ngayon sa umaga ng ito ito po mga kasama ay tungkol po at may kinalaman sa programa ngayon ng uh, BZYF ang 2019 CSR Youth Awards National Finalist kasama natin this morning at uh, Makasama natin po ang ating uh, panauhin. Ayan, sila po ay mga uh, finalists for the 2019 CSR Youth Awards. Okay? So, finalists din po ng CSRYA. Ayan. So, may mga kwento sila sa atin, ibabahaging kwentong bayani. Okay? So, huwag natin pakatagaling pa. Habang inaantabayanan din ho natin in just a few moments, makasama naman natin ang aking partner, si uh, partner Jojo Armenta. We have Jeremy Cresan- Cresencio Law. Live via Zoom. Ayan. Hello, Jeremy. Good morning. Good morning po. Ayan. How are you? How are you today? Je- how, 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 what, what do you want me to call you? Jer- Re- ano, Remy? What? I mean, Jer? Jeremy. Po. Jeremy talaga. Okay. So, Jeremy, kas- may kasama, ba- kasama tayo, no? Right? Yes po. Si Chan Chan Castro. Ayan. a uh, student of Hi, affairs director ng uh, how do you call it? I shift philippines tama jerem uh, chan chan yes po i shift okay so good morning sa inyong dalawa ako munang makasama ninyo uh, jeremy and uh, chan chan for a while pero in, in in a few moments makasama natin ang aking partner jojo armenta at uh, may uh, ano lamang inaasikaso lamang okay umpisahan natin good morning sa inyong dalawa kumusta muna kayong dalawa chan chan and jeremy ayan all good naman po preparing mm. it for the work Wow, talaga naman. And Jeremy, how were you also this morning? Um, okay naman po mm-hmm. for this morning. For this bale, morning. Bale, mamaya, uh, balik busy ulit. Oo oh, oh, nga. <laughs> mga kasama ha, ang ating po mga panoohin ngayon ay sila po ay kasama sa... CSR, no? Youth uh, Awardees po or finalist sa BCYF. Okay, let's start our kwentong bayani. Ayan, topic for today. Jeremy and Chan Chan, pakikwento nga sa amin ano tong iShip? Para, ano ba ang mission nito? Bakit meron tayong iShip na to and vision natin para malaman din na ating mga listeners and viewers? Um, yung iShip Philippines po, uh, Actually, it was formed uh, last 2016. Mm-hmm. Uh, actually, August 7, 2016. So we had our seventh anniversary mm-hmm. uh, in the past uh, in the past days. Mm-hmm. And during that time, um, the only objective lang talaga na I shift is to pay it forward. Mm-hmm. Since the origin of the initiative is that we wanted to give back. Mm-hmm. Uh, pay it forward din sa mga taong tumulong sa amin mm-hmm. along the way during mm-hmm. our college or during okay. our high school. Jeremy, saglit ha, maputol mm-hmm. natin. Papasukin muna natin ang ating partner, ating kasama of course. We have partner Jojo Armenta. Partner, good morning. Good morning. Narinig niyo pa po ako. Yeah, loud and clear. Loud and clear Hi, partner. Hi, magandang magandang umaga ng Sabado po sa ating lahat, sa mga nanonood at nakikinig po sa aming programa ngayong umaga. Partner Jenny, nakikinig na ako since earlier. No? Kasama natin ang two of the people from Aisha Philippines. Um, mm-hmm. Kasama natin ang founder. and president ng IC Philippines si Jeremy Crescentio and of course ang kanilang student affairs director na si Chan Chan Castro. Good morning guys. Sorry, ngayon lang ako. Okay. And uh, going thank you partner Jojo. Ayun kasama tayo ngayon sa kwentong bayani hangga alas 11. So going yes. back nga partner our first question to Jeremy. Paki-kwento sa atin yung vision and mission. So please continue Jeremy. Ayun. So for for that Um, we started helping those kids lang muna sa mm-hmm. um, 
sa mga hospitals who will celebrate Christmas. Mm-hmm. And then, and we all know naman na kapag Christmas, special season yun for the kids. Mm-hmm. Pero ang napili namin that time was the kids sa hospitals. Mm-hmm. And after that event, mm-hmm. um, na-realize namin na we can provide more services. So for ICF Philippines, um, naging mission na namin after that event is to uh, reach out those um, people who are in need in different parts of the country. Mm. So we would like to strengthen the Bayanihan spirit through mm-hmm. social media and allowing people to volunteer with us by uh, by supporting our initiatives mm-hmm. na pinaplot every year. Okay. So ito pala partner Jojo itong high shift ano from Jeremy and Chan Chan. Talagang sa mga bata ano partner ang kanilang uh, gustong pagtulong. Oh, oh, curious ako partner no, mm-hmm. Jeremy or Chan Chan no. Well, especially kay Jeremy. Mm-hmm. Bakit high shift yung pangalan ng organization? Um, yung high shift we named it as that kasi we would like it to be something personal. Yung I it signifies yourself i being involved to something uh relevant and then you shift naman mm-hmm. uh means a certain group of people in a certain period of time so gagaya po namin as a team parang we usually do our communications online lang mm-hmm. and then magkikita-kita na lang po kami at a certain period of time during the events ganyan mm-hmm. and then doon na parang it's a surprise na lang since may mga volunteers na first time a-attend and then magkita-kita doon sa event mm-hmm. and then doon sila magkakilala maka-establish ng friendship and mm-hmm. in the long run sasama na sila Oh, yung pala yun partner. Yo, yeah, something personal. Mm-hmm. Eh ngayon naman, we want to know, no, ano ba yung mga programa ng iShift that you want that you can share to us and our listeners? For iShift Philippines, we have five initiatives. Mm-hmm. So, first is yung education, second is environment, third community involvement, mm-hmm. fourth is yung institution and healthcare, mm-hmm. and then yung fifth is yung special projects. For this year, we have uh, partnerships with different organizations. And um, for this month, meron kaming mga ongoing na pag, uh, pag-support sa mga students with, uh, who are having a hard time na makapag, makapag-gain ng mga supplies for mm-hmm. the upcoming opening ng school. Okay. Uh, and then um, after that, Mm-hmm. Tuloy-tuloy pa rin kami sa aming mangrove tree planting initiatives, um, hospital visits, institution mm-hmm. visits, um, and also sa mga partnerships namin with other organizations sa Pampanga mm-hmm. and other parts of the Philippines po. Oh, dami pala, no? Mga programa ng uh, iShift. Ayan, so maganda naman. Now for, ano, thank you Jeremy. Now for Chan Chan partner, talong ko lang. Hi Chan Chan, good morning again. Ah, uh, pakibigay nga sa amin ng kwento, no? Ibahagi mo yung uh, paano niyo napapalaganap o ginagawa sa iShift yung volunteerism at saka yung uh, personal social. Ito very important to Chan Chan and Jeremy. Personal social respons- uh, response uh, person uh, natin, responsibility natin. Yes, ayan. Hello, good morning everyone. So, Actually, sa iShape, it mm-hmm. all starts with awareness. Okay. Yan, kapag, um, paano ba natin may engage yung mga tao is, mm-hmm. of course, to let them know ano yung kailangan, saan nangangailangan, and paano tayo makakatulong sa nangangailangan. Okay. We have to let them know, we have to let them be aware of mm-hmm. our causes, kung mm-hmm. anong ways pwede silang mag-help. Mm-hmm. And from that, we publicize everything sa media, we engage through digital medias, ganyan, mm-hmm. word of mouth. Kapag kanyari, for example, we have this project and we ano, we reach out yung mga friends namin, family members, ganyan, mm-hmm. to help us dun sa cause na yun. Or maybe they wanted to contribute something, we let them engage. So from that, ni, ni, um, ni-utilize namin yung digital media para mas malaman yung mga causes and projects, upcoming projects namin para they can engage themselves. Mm, okay, maganda pala. No? Ito, alam mo yung pinaka-importante, Jeremy and partner, no? Chan Chan, yung social ano natin, eh, responsibility. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, anything yes. you would like to to add, Jeremy? Um, 
pagdating po kasi sa mga projects po namin, we really make it to the point na we made it personal din. Mm-mm. So, ini-injectan namin siya ng aming personality so that people will be curious mm-hmm. and at the same time, we'll get engagement from them and then dun mag-trigger yung interest nila to join our projects. Mm-hmm. So, may mga titles kami na medyo catchy, ganyan. Mm-hmm. So, if uh, yung iba kasi medyo na yung serious pagdating sa mga ano eh, sa mga CSR projects, Mm-mm. akala nila ano, uh, masyadong serious, hindi na lang mag involve dyan. Pero yung iba, may involve sila dahil witty yung titles ng projects. For Mm-mm. example, we had a, um, a fundraiser for people na, uh, for elderly. So parang gumawa kami ng, stra- ng plan na why not introduce yung wrinkles para sa may wrinkles. Uy, okay yun ah. And then, <laughs> mm. um, Um, like kagaya nung last pandemic, mm. nagkaroon kami ng, uh, na, narinig namin yung problems ng institutions na they've been using their pillows Mm-mm. for the past years. And syempre, during the pandemic, since nasa bahay lang sila, oh, lagi oh. sa nasa bedroom, um, sabi namin, sige, let's provide them some pillows, mm-hmm. new brand or new set of pillows para din discomfortable sila nag stay sa kanilang rooms. Mm-mm. So we named it Higana Unan na. Mm, okay, may so, mga, mga pitik ka. Uh, witty, mm, ganyan. Mm, ganda, maganda siya. Yan, yan, yan partner ano eh, no? maganda sa mga programa yung may datingan na pang uh, mga edara ni ano eh, Jeremy and Chan Chan, di ba? Yeah, at saka nabanggit na kanina, no? Um, yung gamit ng, yung role ng social media and um, the digital era kasi right now is really rising. Mm-hmm. So yung question ko sunod kay Jeremy at kay Chan Chan, like how... Do you guys think being a young person who is in the era of digitalization and the rise of social media, like how can we use and maximize these platforms to um, contribute, no, to advocate volunteerism and social responsibility? Unahin natin. Pero partner, bago sa gutin oh ni Jeremy and Chan Chan, at uh, tayo muna magbibigidaan sa ating ilang paalala partner Jojo Chan Chan and Jeremy. Magpabalik po agad ang programa. Kwento bayani. Oras po natin, 10.34. Balik po tayo sa programang Kwentong Bayani. Ako po si Ranja Manjani Pahilang and of course, ang ating partner, Jojo Armenta and our guest, si uh, Jeremy and si Chan Chan. Partner, ang ganda ng tanong mo kanina. Yes, nabitin tayo kanina, mm-hmm. no? So, kasama po muli natin ang mga taga Aisha Philippines, si Jeremy and si Chan Chan. Mali magandang umaga. So, yung question ko kanina, kasi nga, di ba ang mga kabataan ngayon, we are in the era of social media and the rise of digitalization. So, paano nga ba natin magagamit or maximize itong mga platforms na to to advocate more about volunteerism and social responsibility? Ayan, so... Let me answer that question. No? Um, actually, sobrang daming paraan um, yung pwedeng mag-engage and mag-volunteer yung mga um, tao. Um, um, pwede silang mag-engage through efforts. Like for example, you are good at social media, you are good at making videos, you are good at making um, editing photos. Pwede nyo siyang i-engage through um, volunteering in an org that needs that effort. And also, mm-hmm. pwede rin sila mag-volunteer through in-kind donation, monetary donation. Sobrang dami sa social media. We just type it, search it sa Facebook, mm-hmm. and then, boom, andyan na siya. Pwede na tayo mag-contribute. And mostly, hindi naman kailangan na material thing yung binibigay or money. Um, pwede tayo mag-contribute ng efforts natin. Kung saan skill tayo, pwede. Like, for example, there are organizations as well na nag advocate for storytelling, ganyan. Mm-hmm. They can volunteer as um, vol- volunteer storyteller. Pwede naman tayo mag-volunteer as volunteer um, teacher, facilitator mm-hmm. sa mga ganitong activities and events. Maraming bagay and maraming ways na they can contribute and volunteer sa different organization. Not just in iShape, but in as a whole sa mm-hmm. in the Philippines, organizations in the Philippines. Thank you, Ayon. Si Jeremy. Yeah, si Jeremy, baka may gusto pa i-add. Yung sa akin naman, since kasi ngayon, di ba, most of us are in social media. Oh, oh. And we know naman na yung impact na social media sometimes hindi mm-hmm. siya ganun kaganda, lalo sa kabataan. So we would like to inject uh, good stuff doon sa social media by encouraging everyone to join us on our events, ganyan. Mm-hmm. And then, 
on our part, parang gumagawa kami ng ways talaga to trigger their um their interest to be involved in different uh, volunteering activities so mm-hmm. that um malayo sila doon sa pag pagsistay lang sa social media and not doing anything. So mm-hmm. may marami rin kasi talaga na naghahanap lang talaga ng ways on how they can be involved mm-hmm. by knowing the stories na hindi pa nila nalalaman sa labas. So, yun yung minsan nilalabas namin sa mga pages namin. And then, if wala naman kaming projects, mm-hmm. yung mga stories naman ng iba, tao na yun naman yung mga share namin sa social media. Okay. So, talaga kasi social media ngayon, you know, partner mm-hmm. Jojo. Okay, ito magandang tanong ko, no? Ano ang mga dapat abangan natin o aabangan pa sa iShift, Jeremy and Chan Chan? Sige, ako na lang muna. Yeah, for, for For iShift kasi, um, since ngayon, nagbalik na tayo ulit sa, ano, sa, sa normal. New na normal, ganap, yeah. Um, we would like to inject again yung mm-hmm. engagements doon sa activities namin. Since yun talaga yung nawala okay. in the past three years. Mm-hmm. So, in the coming years, we are aiming to um, to, to partner with large companies. Mm-hmm. So, let's take a start na siya ngayon. Starting November, meron na kami ulit malalaking activities. Mm-hmm. And then by next year, uh, mas creative na yung way para magkaroon ng involvement sa mga activities. Mm-hmm. At the same time, they're helping an, an institution by joining our activities. Mm-hmm. So, may mga bowling tournaments for a cause, mm-hmm. pero may twist. Yung mga ganun po yung mga goals namin mm-hmm. in the coming Uh, in the coming years. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, maganda pa na ng mga programang aabangan sa iShift. Ayan. Okay, partner. Also, kasi next month, partner Jenny, is mm-hmm. we are celebrating Philippine Social Responsibility Month for Uy, BCYF. Galing. So, perfect Oo. na na-invite mm-hmm. natin ang isa sa mga finalists ng 2019 CSR Youth Awards. Mm-hmm. And ngayon, gusto ko namang itanong, no, kasi... I think we haven't really invited um, iShift here in Kwentong Bayani. Mm-hmm. How does it feel? Like, how did it feel when you guys um, became a finalist? Kasi yung proseso ng interview and all, medyo matindi ang process niya. Eh. Mm-hmm. And knowing that you guys are competing, well, not really competing, but like being with a lot of organizations, mm-hmm. or organizations that are really doing well in their in their mm-hmm. field. So how, how did it feel being a finalist? Um, nung 2019 kasi, sa kami sa mga bata talaga na organization. Mm-hmm. And since bata pa organization namin that time, syempre panghinaan ka ng loob kapag namit mo na yung mga seniors mm-hmm. pagdating sa CSR. So during that time, parang isip na lang namin na all you need to do is to be authentic sa lahat mm-hmm. ng ginagawa mo and just be true to what you're advocating. Mm-hmm. So I think that's the reason bakit yung iShift Philippines nakapasok nun sa, as finalist Mm-mm. since pinanghawakan namin yung ano ba yung lessons na nakukuha ng aming mga volunteers uh, by volunteering sa amin Mm-mm. and ano ba yung pwede nilang expect pa sa amin in the coming months Mm-mm. and probably pagdating din sa on how we engage with our volunteers na um, napabalik-balik sila kapag may mga events kami. Mm-mm. Okay, so yun ang maganda okay. pala. May, may so, follow-up question chan. ako, partner. Mm. Um, kasi being kabataan, no, si Jeremy, ano ba yan eh, mga medyo close to my batch yan eh. Mm-hmm. Tapos si, si Chan Chan, I wanna ask, no, like, how do you guys manage your time doing your own thing? Like, if you're doing a particular job, your work, si, si Jeremy, architect din to eh. Oh. Tapos, like, I know, affiliated din si Chanson with a lot of things. So, mm-hmm. How do you manage your time? Because we want to encourage more more young people to do the same, no? Advocate, volunteerism, and social responsibility. Mm-hmm. How do you manage your time doing all these things? Time management. Right, so, Chan-chan, yes. Yeah. So sa akin, ano, personally, 
um, as much as possible, I'll try I'll try na hindi ako mag-uwi ng task ko, ng work ko mm-hmm. sa bahay. And I allot yung weekends actually to find time na mag-volunteer. Yan, sa iShip. Um, yung time namin kasi we allot the weekends talaga oh, para oh. sa mga activities. Tapos from that na um, mag-message na si Kuya Jones na, oh, sino yung free ng ganitong day? Sino yung free ng ganitong oh. time? And sobrang minamaximize namin yung time for holidays to reach out then to conduct oh. activities. Kasi okay. I know and we know na ayun din talaga yung mga time na free din kami mm-hmm. most of us kaya ayun um, siguro sa so- kahit sobrang dami ng work um, always find time lang din to help other people mm-hmm. parang mag-reach out ka sa mga nangangailangan ganyan always find your time and interest kung saan mo gustong tumulong and mm-hmm. mag-help galing naman ano nilalaan talaga nila yung weekend nila tulad ni Chan Chan ano, para sa mga programa ng uh, iShift, di ba, partner? Yun ang magandang ano talaga, social responsibility. Yes, partner. Very busy and very new. Ayan. So, so, siguro ako, sa part ko, siguro blessed lang ako na napunta ako sa company with work-life balance. Okay. So, aware sila na kapag 6pm, um, hindi ah, na ako mag-work. Okay. Ganyan. Oh, oh. So, I have I have a lot of time to uh, to do my tasks, Mm-mm. to prepare stuff for uh, my CSR events. Oh, That's oh. the reason kung bakit ano rin, yung ma-occupy yung mga weekends. Oh, oh. And then kapag holiday, Kasam. pwede, ganyan. And Jeremy, what we're showing right now over our uh, Facebook Live, ito yung namimigay kayo ng mga school supplies, right? Sa mga bata? Mm-hmm. Yes po. Oh, oh. So, so dyan po, actually, may mga times po kasi na mm. syempre, we need to consider the budget. So, okay. we make we make effort na mag-reach out sa different communities mm-hmm. kung pwede sila yung mag-volunteer on our part. Ah. So, doon pa lang, para nakakapag-establish na kami ng connections pagdating doon sa mga tinatap namin na partners sa different parts of the country. Mm-hmm. And then, uh, sila na rin nag-facilitate and then sila na rin yung nag-distribute which is Natutuwa po kami kasi even though magkalayo kami, uh, nagkakonect po kami doon sa one uh, one goal namin is to Mm-mm. support the, the students okay. or the beneficiaries. Mm-mm. Galing. Ang ganda ng plastic nyo, be kind. O, diba? Mm-hmm. Ang ganda. Yes, partner? Partner, parang ano, nagtitravel ka. Ang ganda ng background mo sa likod. Sama kami <laughs> ni Jeremy tsaka ni Chan Chan, ha? Oo. Yeah, oh. Doro, actually, ingat, so. ingat, partner. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Ito, meron kami mm. this universe question. Yan. For, Eto na. Handa for, na. Mm. For, ano, for Jeremy and Chan Chan. Mm-hmm. Bago mo talang hindi ko yung last question, no, partner. Um, kung meron kung meron kang itatanong, Jeremy and Chan Chan, to your, I would say, 15-year-old mm-hmm. self, now that you are in this state, mm-hmm. what would that be? No, not the question. Advice. So, yeah, so you're 15-year-old self. Kunahin natin si Jeremy. Mm-hmm. Um, siguro, I would ask if masaya ka ba sa ginagawa mo? Mm-hmm. Kasi it all revolves around sa kung ano ba yung ginagawa mo. So, may yung lifestyle mo mm-hmm. uh, in the coming years. So, kung hindi ka masaya ngayon, it would affect your um, your mental state or mm-hmm. your lifestyle in the long run. So, okay. kung masaya ka ngayon, it would be best na uh, you look forward for the best champion. Mm-hmm. Yes, thank you naman. Si Chan Chan. Yes, ayan. Ako siguro, um, lagi dun sa ano, goal na what is your passion and mm-hmm. parang how do you, how do you, how you, will you help the people around you? Mm-hmm. Ayan, kasi parang um, lagi yung it um, everything that happens in our life, it will mm-hmm. all boils down kung mahal ba natin yung ginagawa natin mm-hmm. or napipilita lang tayong gawin. And mm-hmm. also, um, parang for me kasi, ang mantra ko sa life is we always live with purpose, di ba? Parang ang purpose naman natin is to help each other din. Kasi mm-hmm. syempre, um, hindi naman tayo, hindi naman natin kayang isolve yung problems natin on our own. So, we need help pa rin talaga, mm-hmm. whether sa friends, sa family, kay mm-hmm. God. Ayan. So, ayun lang. How will you help others? Baka isa ka sa mga makakatulong pala, sa mga mm-hmm. mas nangangailangan. So, at the end of the day, pagtulog mo, may nagkagawa ka mabuti and mm-hmm. you were able to be kind. <laughs> diba? Oo, oh, oh, tama. Ayun. Kaya pala, yung kaninang nakita natin sa mga 
photos ninyo. Ito yung namimigidigay mm-hmm. ng pagkain, no? Jeremy and Chan Chan. There you yes. go. Yes po. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's part of ano nyo ha? Project ng iShift. Okay. So, partner, ayan, na question pa rin natin. Uh, paano nyo nakikita ngayon? Ilang taon mula ngayon? Ang uh, mga programa at plano ng iShift? Ayan, or five years from now? Or four years from now? Paano nyo nakikita ang lawak na ng mga programa at plano ng iShift? Siguro po, ano, actually yung question na yun, nahakiling siya. Kasi mm-hmm. ngayong seven years na kami and looking forward five For years another, from yes. now, parang it would be a great achievement sa organization mm-hmm. na mag-last ng ganong kahaba. Mm-hmm. And ayun, uh, five years from now, may kita namin i shift as, may kilala siya as strong organization mm-hmm. for holding on to what was started before in 2016. Mm-hmm. And more collaborations and more projects na may introduce mm-hmm. to open up uh, possibilities of volunteerism mm-hmm. to different uh, people and even to different organizations. Yeah, and si, thank you, Jeremy. Si Chan Chan, may, adi, may adadagdag ka doon. Ano po nakikita mo? Ayun, um, of course, praying for the best organization. Mm-hmm. And ayun, sana um, mas marami pa tayong ma-reach out na mga tao. Mm-hmm. Not just the beneficiaries, but the volunteers as well. Sana mas marami pang volunteers na mag-engage Uh-oh. with us and mag-reach out together na mga causes natin. So still pa rin pala partner, no? Jeremy and Chancho, you're looking pa rin for more volunteers sa iShift, tama? Yes po, opo. Okay, yes. ayun. So halimbawa, may maggusto nakikinig sa atin at nanonood. Yan, partner, tanong ko na ha, saan pwede na lumapit sa inyo yung mga gustong mag-volunteer sa iShift Philippines? Um, they can visit our Facebook page mm-hmm. and Facebook group. Or we have this iShift Bayanihan Facebook mm-hmm. group where we post usually our initiatives, mm-hmm. ma- mapamaliit man yan or malaki. Um, open na open naman yung organization Uy, for ito that. Yun. Oo. And then, um, example, meron kaming mga volunteer volunteer calls sa Mm-mm. different parts of the country. Mm-hmm. If in case malapit sila doon, pwede naman sila mag-volunteer. Okay, to. ayan. So, pwede silang mag-message dyan, ano? I-like nila at i-share din yung Facebook uh, page. Okay, yes, ayan. Bro. Yes, partner. Yes. So, Jeremy, Chan Chan, invite you naman yung mga kabataan na um, may encourage sila no, to join the CSR Youth Awards for this year. Mm-hmm. And i-share nyo na rin kung ano yung um, pwede nilang paghandaan katulad ng process na ginawa nyo sa CSR Youth Awards. Go ahead. Um, for CSR Youth Awards, we really encourage our um, individuals na who has a heart for CSR and also mm-hmm. for the organization who has the heart for CSR, lalo na ngayon na uh, wabarik tayo sa new normal, I mm-hmm. think it, it's a, it's the best time to present your mm-hmm. projects na nagawa in the past months, in the past years. Pero all I can advise is kapag nandun kayo, na kayo sa stage na um, i-represent yun na, just be yourself, mm-hmm. always go back to the reason why you started that organization or that initiative Mm-mm. para then maging spontaneous yung way nyo on how to deliver everything. Mm-hmm. Kasi it all boils down to, to your heart and not to what's inside your head. Oh, oh tama naman. Iba. Chan Chan, anything you would like to add? Ayan. Um, the, the door for voluntary sim is opening as mm-hmm. we go back to new normal and napakaraming dapat tulungan, napakaraming mm-hmm. dapat i-work out. So, for those um, young audiences there na gustong mag-build up ng org or mag-push for an organization, mm-hmm. ayun nga, sabi ni Kaya Jeremy, the purpose and yung reason kung bakit in mm-hmm. the first place nag-ano tayo dito, nag-create tayo ng organization or win a workout natin to. Doon lang lagi tayo babalik kung ano yung mga um, goals natin for that organization. So, mm-hmm. always go back sa vision and mission. Tama. At sana kahit hindi na kayo mga kabataan pa rin, magpapatuloy pa rin yung inyong ano, no? vision and mission. Yes. Ayan. Okay. So, maraming salamat, partner. Anything na uh, gusto nating idagdag pa rin with Jeremy and Chan Chan? So, I would like to just thank um, Jeremy and Chan Chan for um, spending time with us this morning. And congratulations. Dahil seven mm-hmm. years na ang I share. Yes. I you. hope I hope that we could collaborate more on no, sa DCYF and together with other youth organizations mm-hmm. to develop more 
more at um advocacy days um projects no so congratulations and thank you so much jeremy and chan chan thank you jeremy and chan chan more power thank ayan you. okay so partner si jeremy crescencio ang founder ng iship philippines kasama natin si chan chan ano sa bahagi pa rin ng iship ang galing ano yung kanilang volunteerism talagang nilalaan nila yung oras nila para lang sa mga programang makatulong sa kanilang kapwa sa mga bata din di ba Ako, no? Yes, partner. Oo, kasi, yes, kasi isa sila sa mga <laughs> talagang nakitaan din namin ng potential mm-hmm. to um, reach more young people to do uh, volunteer work. Mm-hmm. No, at hanggang ngayon, nagpapatuloy sila na mag, magtaguyod ng ganitong classing organization to encourage more mm-hmm. um, young people and um, youth organizations to strive harder Good. to advocate personal social responsibility. Yes. And partner, any announcement or gusto natin iparating pa rin ako sa ating mga nakikinig at nanonood at i-like and share din ang inyong ating BCYF no? official official Facebook page. Yes, muli po namin kayo ini-invite na mag-follow and mag-share sa aming um, Facebook page, BCY Foundation. And also, we have BCYF TV channel. So, para po sa mga events and past um, activities ng BCYF, pwede po silang mapanood doon. At please, samahan niyo po kami sa susunod naming mga episode pa dito sa Kwentong Bayani. Kasi next month ay Philippine Social Responsibility Month na. September. Oy, oh, oh. Philippine yeah. Social Responsibility Month for September. Abangan niyo yan sa B- aming programang Kwentong Bayani. But until next week pa rin, partner, and the two weeks from now pa rin before the September, tuloy-tuloy pa rin tayo sa ating mga episode na pagbibigay ng mga Kwentong Bayani. Yes, at inaaya po namin muli kayo kung meron kayong kilalang social entrepreneur mm-hmm. at isa kayo sa, sa so isang social entrepreneur, pwede po kayo mag-submit hanggang August 14 po ang deadline ng nomination for Developmental Social Enterprise Awards. Oy, this coming Monday yan, part, uh, partner, no? August yes, 14. Yes. Oo. So, so mag-nominate uh, na po kayo. Mm-hmm. And they can look no for uh, more details sa uh, official Facebook page ng BCYF. Okay, correct, correct, yeah. So, yeah, the seventh developmental social enterprise award 2023. And abangan yun po uh, two weeks from now. Then by September, sabi ng yung ating social responsibility month. Okay, so partner, yes. tayo ay uh, magbabalik next Saturday. Ayan at ingat ka sa biyahe mo kung saan man ang iyong uh, punta ngayon, partner. Ang ganda ng iyong ano jan background, di ba? <laughs> Ayan kasi sa mga basigwa po. Yes. Oh, oh. Hello. Hi. Napakaano naman niya bait. Ayan. So partner, ayan tayo magbibigay daan sa ating uh, pasasalamat. At uh, maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat. Go ahead partner. Yes. Muli nagpapasalamat kami sa ating mga guests for this morning. Kay Chan Chan, kay Jeremy ng Aisha Philippines. At muli abangan niyo po ang ating mga susunod na episode dahil maraming po tayong mga inspirational and motivational na guest speakers. Um, guests sa ating, um, sa ating programa every Saturday po yan. Okay. At muli, nagpapasalamat mula sa DCYF ako po si Jojo Armenta. At mula naman po sa RMND sa XL558 Manila sa programa pong ito sa muli po sa Sabado alas 10 hanggang alas 11 ng umaga dito po sa DCXL558 sa programang Kwentong Bayani. Bayani.